Well, Jawan, how do you explain the, the second half performance up 12 and then it just seemed like nothing went right after that? Uh, I don't know, but it was kind of hard to see what was going on being in the game, but I know they got a lot of second chance opportunities that led to and ones and putbacks. Uh, and that's what gave them the game. You guys can get these leads in some of these these games, but then can't hold them. I mean, is, is this team just lacking a, a killer instinct, I guess, the step on the throat kind of mentality? Uh, you could say that. I mean, I don't know. I think it's our concentration. I think over 40 minutes, we just have a problem concentrating over 40 minutes. We kind of play in spurts, and then we go droughts where we don't score, or droughts where we can't get a stop. So I think that's concentration. Can you kind of sense when one of those lack of concentration moments is coming? Uh, yeah, I can I can sense it because um, for for the most part we get pretty good movement uh, and we get good shots. But once our offense get kind of stagnant, uh, we tend to get stagnant on the defensive end too. Uh, so I can always see it coming, but I mean that's just something that we have to fight against. Do those missed shots affect you, not you personally, but the team on the defensive end? Uh, put your miss a shot, put your head down, and something bad happens on the other end of the floor. Is that something? Is that a trend or something? That, uh, I don't. I don't know if our missed shots uh, affect us on the defensive end. Um, I think on the defensive end, we just tend to to relax a lot. Um, guarding the ball, sometimes we relax and get beat off the dribble, or or a guy that's supposed to rotate is, is relaxing because the ball's on the opposite side of the floor, and then he's his rotation comes, he misses it, and they get a basket. So I think we just tend to relax. Uh, sometimes they give up the easy baskets. Is that what happened with those second shots tonight, or was that a product of? the defense that you were in? Um, I mean, we were playing good defense. They were taking shots, and they were missing all of the first shots. Uh, we just weren't, weren't boxing out and, and getting rebounds. Uh, we let uh, Osby get a lot of the rebounds uh, and putbacks, and then we were fouling him on top of that. So, I mean, we kind of gave that away. Terry said a couple times, he said, you know, this isn't a second half team. He said that just unprovoked when we were talking to him a minute ago. Is this in your all's head as a team in any, in any way at this point that, you know, you sort of see it coming, like you said, and it's just almost self-fulfilling? Uh, no, I wouldn't say that, but, I mean, that's, that's starting to become a trend. Um, I mean, sometimes we come out and play better in the second half. Uh, I know a lot of times we've been down the first half, come out in the second half and kind of fight back. Uh, I think it's just when we had a lead going into halftime, we tend to relax. Uh, we relax in the second half, and then the team gets on a run, and it's kind of hard to turn it off and turn it back on. Uh, I think that's our problem. Well, yeah, you can, you can, you can talk about all the technical stuff and everything else, but the fact of the matter was it came at seven two-point baskets in 40 minutes. And, I mean, that, that just doesn't go. Uh, what, do you, what happened? What do you think um, Well, early we, we were hitting all of our shots. Uh, we were playing pretty good defense and we were rebounding the ball. Uh, as the game went on, we started missing those same shots that we were making at the beginning. Uh, defense got a little bit relaxed and, and that changed the game.